Well, for the second week in a row, as you can see right here, Roxon and Anderson have come together. So the question is about this one. Anderson said, or you know, people are saying that it's just two lines came together. So the question becomes now, is clean or dirty? Obviously you can tell there was a lot of contact in this. And yes, it is a sand section, so lines aren't really all that determined. There was an inside and an out, and it kind of looked like Anderson was on, well, obviously was on the inside, blew out the inside berm of the sand section or whatever you want to call it, and obviously the lines did come together, but the question becomes, that's the second week in a row, Anderson has hit Roxon. Last week he took out his front wheel, which was obviously a much less of a contact, it was just kind of a, you know, inside out, he took the front wheel of Roxon down. This one obviously had a lot more contact, and in both weeks, Anderson has gotten the the good end of the stick. I don't know. He's finished up front this week. Obviously, he had some bike issues last week. But, you know, this week, Roxon ended up being way down on the pack because he was stuck down in the sand for a long time with the sand, you know, sand in his goggles where, Rock, where as Anderson, you know, did as you should do. If you take somebody out, you really shouldn't be the one that goes down. And as you can see right there, I mean, there was a lot of contact. He went straight up underneath Roxon. So the question becomes, clean or dirty? Do you think this is just a racing move that, you know, two lines came together and shit happens? Or do you think this is just, you know, over-aggressive riding, which really didn't need to happen because obviously he looked like he was faster than Ruxin? You tell me. Peace.